One of my favorite things that you can do inside of Google Ads is place specific advertisements on other websites across the internet. Now, I've done videos on this channel about how to set up that type of campaign, but today I wanna share with you how you can find out if another website is actually enrolled with Google so that you could place advertisements on that site. I'm gonna share with you how you can find out if that website is running Google AdSense ads, and if they are, there's a good chance that you can place an advertisement directly on their site. My name is Scott Redgate, I'm an online marketing coach, and if you wanna save some money inside of your Google Ads account, make sure to grab my free PPC cost-cutting cheat sheet. You can get it at scottredgate.com slash cheat sheet, and I'll leave a link in the description below. So websites all across the internet have the ability to opt in to different advertising networks. So there are a lot of them, but one of the most popular is Google AdSense. This means that those websites are reserving spots on their websites that run Google Ads. And so those websites will get a cut of the revenue from all the clicks that happen on those display ads. And while it's usually not the best performing campaign inside of an account, and I've done videos on this in the past, it's one of my favorite things to do to handpick websites across the internet. Sometimes that can be competitors' websites, sometimes that can be the most popular websites on the internet, and place specific advertisements for your business. I'm not gonna run through all the steps for how to create that campaign. If you want to run through all the steps for how you can create a display campaign targeting specific websites, make sure to watch this video. But I'm gonna share with you how you can find out if you're able to run advertisements on another website and see if they have Google AdSense ads on their site. So here we go. So I am on NBCnews.com. And let's say you wanna find out if your business is able to run advertisements on NBC News. Well, one of the easiest ways that you can find out is if you actually find an advertisement that's on the website. And normally on the top right of advertisements, you'll see this thing right here, which says ad choices. And if you click that, you'll see if that is a Google AdSense ad or you'll see whatever the ad network is. So let me click this right here. And it looks like this is not a Google ad. This is controlled by Yahoo. And so if you have a Google ads account, this is not one of the slots that you'd be able to get. And so you can start scrolling through the page and trying to find all the different advertisements, but I wanna give you an easy way to find out if NBC News in this example is running Google AdSense ads so that you could run a campaign targeting ads on NBC News. The easiest way is to go to this website right here, which is called builtwith.com. And all you have to do is input the domain of the website that you wanna advertise on. And then Built With is going to spit back a lot of the technology profile of that website. So you don't have to look in the HTML code. You don't have to do anything complicated. You just now have to go through this list and search for Google AdSense to see if they're running AdSense ads. So I just searched for AdSense and I can see that NBC News is in fact running Google AdSense ads. Okay, so the next step that we're gonna take is when you are creating a display campaign and you get to this option right here, which is placements, now all you have to do is type in NBC News, see if they are one of the options here in this website section, and they are, and then you simply select nbcnews.com as your placement. Now again, we're not gonna run through all the steps of creating this type of campaign, but make sure you have optimized targeting set to off, because if you have optimized targeting set to on, it will bypass your specific placement and target other websites out there on the internet. And now something that I want to note here is there's a lot of instances where you'll confirm that a website is running Google AdSense ads and you'll search for their domain here and they will not pop up. If that's the case and you still wanna see if you're eligible to run advertisements on them, in this enter section right here, go in and type the domain name and then you can simply select ad placement. If you've confirmed that that website is running Google AdSense ads and you create a campaign and you select that website as a placement and you run that campaign for a little bit and you're not getting any impressions, something that could have happened is when that website was setting up their Google AdSense account, they might have blocked your website specifically or they could have even blocked an entire industry from advertising on their website. So for example, what might that look like? Well, NBCnews.com might have blocked any other news website from being able to run advertisements on their website. And so in that instance, something like Fox News wouldn't be able to target ads on NBCnews.com. 
but there's no way to confirm whether or not you were blocked. So the best way to just to find out is to run ads and then see if you can get any impressions on that website. Now I am enrolled in Google AdSense for my YouTube channel. So I've got a message right here that says blocking controls have been moved to YouTube studio, but for websites that are enrolled through Google AdSense via their website, the blocking controls would appear right here in this AdSense section.